Wait, can I hear that nice one again? So the bongo player gets attacked by a bear. Bongo player gets attacked by a bear. All right, here we go. I've been running the Wildlife Society of OKC for about 20 years now. And it is the best society since the Society of the Women's Act in the beginning of 1872. I was born and raised in this forest. Actually, my mama gave birth to me right on the stump of a tree. Had about eight wheat greens and made it about 80 years old. And so, I was basically the blood of this, this nice, nice forest society. And we have nice little we have some animals, and most of them are pretty friendly. We have a couple chipmunks that run around, and they kind of just run around and poop, and that's all they do. <laughs> I am basically the manager of this entire, entire thing. I sit at the gate, and you know, when things get crazy, sometimes I pull out my pocket knife, and it has, you know, it has a nice little toothpick, and I can gouge somebody's eyes out with it. Don't try me. <laughs> and whenever those teenagers come over there, and they get drunk, or they go sit in the car and do whatever those teenagers do, like kissing and mm, I don't go there. I try to stay away from the ladies. But I go in there and I will scare the living crap out of them. Trust me on it. But lately, we've been having some crazy bear problems. Now, do you think the Kool-Aid maybe made you like imagine? 
imagine that. No, 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 no. It was cool. And uh, they had some crazy shit in that cooler. Yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> it was probably the uh, cooking spices. Yeah, we had a lot of oregano tonight. <laughs> Anyways, can you please like get that old okay. man out? Kid, kids, um, look, you, you've had the Kool-Aid and the oregano. You just need to go home and sleep this off. All right, I'm not gonna report you because I'm tired. Anyway, just. <laughs> <laughs> Designated driver? Yeah. Dee Dee? No, no. You can go hiking home. Get walking. Hitchhiking. Tooth picker? Tooth. 
not as interesting as the bears, but that's okay. We'll put it in the brochure. Anyway, so okay, we got bears the brochure. and brochure. I'm going to be a star. Yeah, the, the star with the stump. It'll be great. <laughs> um, that that could be the headline. Star with stump. When do you think I could get my own TV show? <laughs> <laughs> let's, just, let's just get a steady flow of tourists first, then we'll talk TV. Okay? You're right, you're right. First I'll write a book. <laughs> okay, I, I don't mean to like offend you or anything, but you can't write, right? Like, see, see, that you depends. Can, you can do Your drawings this. count. <laughs> <laughs> I can maybe interpret your cave drawings. Cave drawings. <laughs> <laughs> stump drawings. <laughs> Sorry, stump drawings. Okay, uh, famous stump drawings. We'll, we'll include that. That'll be great. That's great. Yeah, how much money are you willing to put down on? Oh, money? Yeah, I, I don't work for free, you know. I got oh. bills to pay, I got mouths to feed. Is there any chance I can pay you like six leaves a week? It depends on the leaves. <laughs> <laughs> I sell them. Evergreen needles, same thing. You know that economy. Kids will smoke anything. Yeah, sounds good. Oh. All right. <laughs> My name is going to be in bright, bright city lights. <laughs> I decided to get started on my book a little bit, but I kind of started to realize nothing really interesting has been happening to me lately. I mean, I, I sit at the gate and I let people in, I take their money, I go and pick up the bear poop, and that's about it. So I decided I need to spice things up a little bit and maybe try to find a lady in my life. You know, sometimes these old, you know, you see those old grizzly men like me, and you guys, you, know, you underestimate us. Eight four four two six seven nine three two one. Oh my God! You look exactly like your avatar. I never thought I would see this day. Oh my goodness! You look exactly like your human paladin. Oh my God! World of Warcraft forever. Okay. Oh my God. I know this is really upfront, but um, I mean, I'll buy you dinner first. It might be twigs, but would you like to see my stump? Your stump? My house. <laughs>
should be like, oh, honey, you're such a perfect match. No. Is this the, excuse me, is this the right stop for me to go to? Hi, I'm Cheryl's brother. <gasps> Wonderful to meet you. This is Eddie. <gasps> Don't Eddie. we look alike? Yes. I see it. <laughs> Almost like my resemblance with Will Smith. Will You don't see it?
soon. I just assumed since I bought you dinner. <laughs> Instead of catching it. It was here. <laughs> there was no leaves or, or twigs. I mean, where was the dirt? There's just sauce and don't butter. Don't worry, we'll stop at that maple tree on the way. I'm going grab it really soon. Hey, are y'all the ones that are holding the, the show with the, the bongo player? Yes, yes, that's us. Nice to meet you. Yeah, 
Because there are some well, bears uh, around here. We just I, I did, don't want them to eat I did take shit. a trip to the slaughterhouse to get some new cowhide from the Bronco. Oh. Is that my good problem? Oh, oh, can I just fine. give a sniff? No, man, it's all, it's all Let me cool, just give honey. a sniff. Okay, sniff the ball. <laughs> But 